In this video, we will learn how to insert count function in Excel sheet. So let's start. So this is my Excel sheet and here I'm going to count of this amount column. So I select first this cell. Okay. Then go to the formulas tab and in function libraries group have an insert function option. Just click on it and here the insert function dialog box is open. Select the count function. And here you can see the counts, the number of cells in the range that contain the numbers. So you see the meaning of this count function also. And click on OK to insert it. Just click on OK. And here the function arguments dialog box open for the count function. Okay, the value one range is automatically selected because I select this cell. cell. Therefore, only this column range is selected here for value one. The amount also here showing and here the fine formulas result also showing the 10 count okay so just click on ok to get the result and here you see the 10 count showing okay and the second way again go to the formulas tab uh, in here you can see the auto sum option just click on this drop down arrow and click on the count numbers option and just here you can see the data is selected and with the count function just press the enter key of the keyboard to get the count of this column okay and the third just select the full data okay i select here the full data and here you can see the one icon the quick analysis okay when you keep cursor on this icon you see the name of this icon the quick analysis just click on it and in go to the total tab okay totals and here you can see the count when you keep cursor on it and here you get the count of all column price unit sold and total amount all column count is 10 okay same as you you get the count in column also just click on this drop down arrow sorry just click on this arrow and here you can see the count option when you keep cursor on it you can see on column count also get here okay so this is a way you count get and uh, that's it so and the uh, one more way you can get the count so use this your function is equal to count enter the count and here you can see the function list and select your count function place the tab select the area of data so here you can see the selected d2 to d11 and use the bracket close and press the enter key of the keyboard to get the count here so this is a way you calculate the count of any column or row so hope you understand this different way so if you like this video please subscribe my channel thank you so much